Well, matchups are weird for me. Yeah, no, no one plays uh, Gengar. It's kind of weird. It's, it's yeah. been like five years, but no one knows what Gengar does. Oh, we'll see it. I think we'll, see, we'll move into the final game. What matchup will we see? We oh, will. Yep, we no, will see the Scepter. In Mystery Carnival. So another uh, Bergy favorite stage right here. Yeah, <laughs> Bergy with the advantage. Uh, we'll see Vitini for uh, Bergy, obviously. But we'll, we'll, I want to see what uh, uh, Snobby will, uh, will pick. I want to see how much meter he gets to start off. Um, I mean, Antwerp. What does he get? Oh, nothing. nothing. Like, I'm sorry, you Veltal here. Ooh, yeah, wanting to shut down that, um, the burst. It's just so long as he can actually, uh, find options to land it with, but Leaf Blade can stun into it, so it's a def it's definitely a, a good option to actually run with. Yeah, and then, like, if, if, uh, if Bergy can't burst and meter management, it's kind of, uh, useless, you know? Ooh. Oh, unfortunately, uh, Bullet Seed there, yeah, but, that uh, that, that leaf be, blade, yeah. that leaf blade is going to be a menace in this matchup. Yeah, he can't like permeate out of stuff just because of that leaf blade presence. Good little mix up from Bergy, keeping a pretty, a pretty solid, uh, solid state in the middle of this really weird mix up option. But goes for another grab. He's well on his way to burst. Antwerp oh, sitting half meter. Up, yeah. Somehow Bergy is sitting on more meter than Antwerp. Well, but here it is. You fell to. Ooh. Yep, getting that quick charge with that back Y. Oh, grab this? I don't... No, I don't think he can grab, can he? No. Tries... Uh, oh, get, I, I he don't think he can perfect block it. Oh, that oh, yeah, leaf yeah. like crit. That did so much damage, even though we only had 6 HP. <laughs> it it would have did so much damage. Yeah, unfortunately oh, not... Um, not realising that. Unfortunately, Bergen not realising that Leaf Blade uh, distance, but... Yeah, Antwerp... Um, Soon has to fight this massive menace of Mega Gengar. But does he? He has he built one deck already, so he, he might not have to fight it. Yeah, that is true. And there we go. Oh, there now we is. see it. We don't yeah. see the Gengar, the Mega Gengar, rather come straight out though. Good eight Y. That eight Y is actually going to be so good in this matchup. Oh. Oh, he gets confirmed for that bullet <laughs> seed right here. Right, that here late. <laughs> yeah, that's a confirm. He uh, he's not dealing with it. Alright, we're seeing a, a Giga Drain. Right oh, here. that's Even that's more. tough to hit too. That's very tough to hit. But I actually, I actually can't remember if Giga Drain actually works when um a Veltal Steed Buff is on. Maybe not, but I uh, mean, it's the meter's gone regardless of what happened. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, Antwerp takes our first round, uh, first game regardless, very cleanly, and I think he's. He's gone into this with a very solid plan, not like yeah. trying to trying to disallow that meter as long as he can, and a it being the strategy. it being like the crutch of um it being the ah cr oh, there you go reliable frame kill there you go no, being no. a uh, it being like a crutch of Bergy's plan he kind of has to kind of uh, think of something else to do um or, I suppose around that yeah getting Mega Gengar every round is useless when like. You can't actually use it. Mm. But uh, okay, we're seeing uh, who won the first phase. It looks like Ant have won first phase. Gets uh, the see uh, uh, get drops that. It's fine. We're gonna see Ooh. a really cool one. Oh, get no curse though, but uh, it's fine. Oh, oh unfortunately, unfortunate. trying to detect through, but Bergy absolutely ready for that. Midi me right there. Oh. Losing a bit of meter, yeah, <laughs> he's taking more. Antwerp sitting on next to none. Bergy sitting on about seventy percent. Yeah, the back way, he's, fi he's fifty fifty and all the way through. This is this is tough. Oh, okay. Oh, this is gonna be B damage here, and be or maybe up to a reset. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't exactly kill, but <laughs> yeah, this is rough. There's the bigger Gengar that oh, can is. punish it well. You built to okay. Uh, oh, I'm not ready for that. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, that's punished there. That's so scary because because it comes becomes so committal when um when the actual bind swing comes out. And yeah, Bergy absolutely ready with that Mega Gengar. Gets forty percent of his meter back, and there we go, even more that's meter back. Uh, you built on the on online for. Uh, Phantom if he ever chooses to use it. 
Probably just confirm into it, so that's the easiest way to do it. Oh, yeah, there it is. yeah, you, you're probably a cleaner way to actually... That's a lot oh. of damage, holy yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot of damage. That's a um, deep bit defense, but... You probably yeah. prefer a cleaner way to actually lead into a belt, or something oh, that is only is. A, 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 a one use a support. He's gonna try and get out of it, but yeah, no permeate is long enough for that dead. one. Yep. This is a kill, yeah. I didn't realize that. <laughs> Good round from Antwerp, barely taking yeah. any damage there. And he's built up yet again, but Vitini up or not. Oh, stealing that nugget. Oh, stole Ooh. it. But does it really matter? Yeah. Ooh, try to duck that, but I don't think you can actually duck that. Nah, it's mid high, I believe. I could be wrong there. Yeah, maybe this one's look cool. Ooh, stuff said that. Yeah, the astonish right there. Oh, it is a high, so you can duck that. So you just like. Oh, it duck. is. I actually didn't know. Oh, actually, no, that makes uh, sense. Yeah. Not, I've armored it with Blastoise before, yeah. So, yeah, that's that cleanly goes into it. This being. Oh, means, oh yeah, it's just think, misses but... it. That, that was a distance thing, that wasn't a timing thing. Yeah. But, um, yeah, this is this is rough. Bergy now, um, sitting on. Oh, he oh, got... does give you melee if you have the the deep on. Okay. Yeah, so support support gives it, and, um, any sort of action by the character does not. Though he's got Mega Gengar again. Able to time oh. out that uh, debuff mid combo, so. Oh, the punish is gonna be a bit damage. That's that might be the most reckless thing I have ever seen Antwerp do. Yeah, not I'm even opting to, hit, not even opting to hit confirm using one of the most laggiest options that um that has uh the the Sceptile has. That is, yeah, that's reckless, and especially against the Mega Gengar, you don't want to be doing that. Or maybe you do want to do that. Oh, if you want to lose, yeah. Yeah, I think I think you wanted to lose, make it more fun. You know what I mean? Leaf Blade go brr, says Antwerp. Ah, uh, it's actually Dragon Breath. After it. And uh, we're seeing here that uh, Antwerp voted for himself in the game. That's kind of weird, dude. No, no, he voted player two. Who's player two? Oh, you, you voted for Bergy. <laughs> huh? At least you're humble. Oh, I have to quit. Oh. Alright, here we are. We're going to, going to a Phosphor Volcano here. Phosphor Volcano. Oh, show me the Groudon. Show me the Groudon. Yeah! Oh, yeah, we saw it. It's like, I think there's a Heatron in the stage, too. Yeah, there's there is. One in the background. Yeah. He's, he's, he's climbing on the wall. Yeah, there's a bunch. So, yeah, this is Antwerp's home stage. Got a bunch of yep. stabilize. Uh, do we quickly play it? Oh, this backdash. Nice. Get to Ooh, the very good. GY. Yeah, good JY. Good backdash too, he's doing a oh, lot of one. movement options here. Uh, you probably wanted yeah. to do the JY. Yeah, th that was a JY. <laughs> Ooh, able to get out of the um out of that before he's punished, that's good on him. Well oh, hypnosis. Uh Ooh. Oh, the read, but it's just the although that's still gonna do a heap of damage. Antwerp slowly chipping out these like small options. Yeah, like it's not it's not much damage per interaction, but it's it's doing a lot in the long run. He's down to 61 HP. This is... Yeah, that's that's it. Does the sidewipe, but Sceptile's mobility able to just get him in range just so quickly. It's so, yeah. Don't really want to throw out an option um, so easily against Sceptile. You need Ooh, to... Ooh, this catch? Calculate more. This... This might... Oh, you oh, see will. it again. Mm. Okay, Mega Gengar won't be a thing for this round, most likely. Yeah. Oh, getting rid of the uh, wall confirmed there. Getting rid of the meter game. Oh, Ooh, that's I'm Shadow Punch. Right. Going through that's here. That's not here, bad, by the way. Now, oh. Bergy can uh, gain meter again, so. Oh, very close, but yeah, unfortunately unable to get out of there. That 2Y, two, that two a fantastic uh, quick Good, option uh, that you can just use, though. Yeah, the hypnosis. That's a grab. That's probably gonna get rid of his burst. Yep. Oh, well, okay. A little quite. bit left. A little bit left, but uh. Okay, he tried to do something there. Mostly, uh, he tried to press it there, but he couldn't. Okay, quickly fleet. Oh, this, this, I don't know if this kills, but it's gonna be me dead. Nah, I don't reset. think so. Oh, good reset. Good reset. Yeah, keep, and he was just playing the around all these. Yeah. Playing around the seeds, that's a good option. It was uh, clear that, um... It was clear that, you know, that wasn't gonna kill. So yeah, get the knockdown and set up as much as you can. He does exactly that. Very well done to Antwerp.
Yeah, and uh, we got 201 to enter up at the moment. We're going to the near city night. Yeah, this is a, it's a, a very clean like set from uh, Antwerp, which is very different from the uh, the first one. With the yeah, Richard, I'm still stuck weird. on I'm still stuck on the uh, on the dragon breath. But outside of that, yeah, this is this is so different to what we saw before. Like Antwerp um, staying up in uh, Bergie's face. And just getting small little interactions, being able to slowly chip away at the health. But in the long run, it's meaning so much, as we saw like earlier. And there we go, that's a that's a field phase win, he starts up on his meter. Well, he tries to preempt that, uh, that, uh, Permier, but, but uh, just missing the unfortunate. Oh, Leaf Blade, yeah, okay, more meter drained away from, uh, Ice Buggy here. And that's a so, massive amount of damage there, yeah, going to, uh, Knocking straight down, tries to dash through that eight wise ridiculous. All right, we're gonna see a random leaf storm in uh, five seconds. <laughs> oh, that was close. Love it. There's the eight Y again. Yeah, well, you got the number right. You got eight right. Yeah, yeah. And I got an anti air right. Oh yeah. All right. So that option, that option there is actually really smart. With that, um, when the opponent's at a low enough HP, raise a leaf or whatever it is. Septile doesn't know. Raise a leaf. Um, like. You can't get hit by it once because as soon as you get hit by it, you obviously you die. But yeah. usually the option is just walk straight through it because that's all light. But when you're at one HP, there's really nothing you can really do there unless you're like a specific character or something. Very, very oh, strong yeah. eight wire. He's a very strong eight wires coming out from Antwerp. Yeah, and yeah, Antwerp's not letting Gengar lick him. That's a uh, as we learned, it's a, it's a high. So, uh, oh. Loki's trying to get as much wind as possible. That reach. Okay, this is gonna be a more strong trained. option. Yeah, this is loss of meter for Antwerp and a slight meter gainage for uh, for Bergy. He oh, needs. Ah, you have to ward the land. Yeah, unless it catches the uh, the, the down right there. Ooh. Oh, oh. Uh, more. Okay, you're gonna see Mega Gengar this game. Yeah, Mega Gengar. It's about there to it come is. out. Yeah, because oh, all he needs to do is win this one. Oh, yeah, it's it's a very scary option to try and um to try and actually beat. Oh wait, he's, he's getting won. this stuff out though. I don't know. Nah, I don't think they'll kill. Oh, but he gets. Oh no. Nah. Okay, kill. One HP. Here's the uh, the meter. If he <laughs> here it is. Yeah. But oh, Gengar can back Y. So Gengar is a character with an option for it. Oh, okay. He's... Oh, oh he drops. It. And yeah, he has burst. Okay. So. He's... Of he's bursty, so he... Yeah. <laughs> he even gets the burst attack off. So we get to watch this. How much do you reckon this is doing? Ah, uh, at least two. No, oh, you're wrong. Yeah. No, I did one. No, kind of weird. Except the PA kind of sucks. But the time was actually like really low too. He was, uh... At the time of our uh, burst, that burst was, uh... Uh, 0.93. Oh, is this a reset? Yeah, oh, yeah, really? sorry, sorry, I'm, I'm just tuning it, I don't know why I'm tuning out, but... Nice. Yeah, that's that's the reset, and yeah, the, the burst was really late from Antwerp, though we see Fossil oh. Volcano again, there's Heat Ran. Yeah, nice. I love me a good Heat Ran, oh, this is, this is a stable arrow. Sh show me, show me Groudon, there's Groudon. It's all Groudon. Yeah. And there's Torko, let's go nice. Torko. Oh, there's Disable Arrow, yeah, it's... Archaeops. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, actually we... really good. Oh, yeah, yeah, this, this stage is sick. Well, this is gonna do, uh, decent. Okay, this shitty. Opting to stay in field phase, this is actually honestly not oh, too yeah. bad. He's trying to but get the, the two nuggets right there while, uh, trying to play Minesweeper. Oh, nice. Oh, worth nice. Worth punish, yeah. <laughs> Although, somehow that hitting, I have no. Uh, yeah, absolutely a, I don't know no how that hit. Oh, gets a bullet seed. Oh, gets the corner of uh, no, no volition of his own. Okay. I don't know. I, I don't again, know. How again, same thing. Oh, and gets, uh... being able to grab in the middle of a frantic situation. Good job to Bergy. That's a crit, so that's a good amount of damage. Oh, that backdash was nice. Uh, well, we see a grab here from Antwerp. Yep. This is going to do 90 damage. Yep. Nice grab. Ooh. Yeah, good, good, um, good iframe through that. Now I'm seeing a leaf storm in five seconds. 
Oh, it doesn't matter though, he's just gonna do the regular, he gets the wall split, so he is in the oh. lead. Now he's not though. It doesn't matter, he is. Yeah, it <laughs> he doesn't just matter. leaf blades. Crit leaf blade at the tipper, that's a lot of damage. And that's really bad for Bergy, now he's uh, all his meter. Yeah, meter used and um, and he didn't get his cheer because he needs to win to get his cheer, so. Yeah, that I mean, was, he's, that he's was actually. Continue, but, uh... Yeah, but it's. I don't know, it's gonna be. It's definitely gonna be a lot harder for him to get meter. He's probably gonna be opting for more uh, synergy. He's uh, very different from uh, a Mega Gengar. See, Rutini isn't that good, but Mega Gengar, Mega Gengar is cool. That's that hit. Yeah, it's but a weird hit. You built it up for uh, Antwerpy if he. So that's the... Yeah, even if he just... Oh, oh that was unfortunate. So unfortunate. He had the right option. He knew exactly what he wanted to do there, but... Oh, he didn't go for that. I don't think he can offer that, offer that one. Oh, leak into uh, the crew set into uh, a grab. Unfortunately. Oh, tries to back dash something. Gets hit by uh, the forward ride that right there. Oh, I, think, I actually can't remember if that forward ride counts as a projectile because you can't back. No, nah, it, oh. it, it's not. Oh, so it's not? So it's actually I think so. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Back there, that could be it. Oh, that's actually a pretty good option there. Yeah, Just get those, guess... all those hits in. Oh. Yeah, that's so smart. Wow. That's so smart. Oh, yeah, that was, yeah, that, that was, was so good. I'm actually curious. Not... I'm actually curious when uh, Antwerp, if, you're, if you can quickly respond to it or not. Um, is Giga Drain a set amount of damage after a, like certain amount of scaling? Like you know how uh, Dark Rise Dream Eater is a certain amount of damage. Is it is that the same for Sceptiles? Just get to that, and I'll probably see the response after. Don't think so. All right, so I just did a lot. <laughs> it's all scale. All right, no, we're not winning the lottery here, but it's uh, it's okay. Oh, that leaf blade crit, You're walking forward on the on the shadow punch, and uh, no giga drain on that CA, but it's fine. Get jumping onto the, the shadow ball, unfortunate. Oh, a lot of shadow balls here coming up for from Buggy. Or Ooh. you didn't see any see that the grab, but it's fine. Yep, oh, that CA being bad. Ah, uh, uh, all right. So, fun fact: I was in VC as a. Ant actually was playing this with him, and he said something like, how'd that hit me? That Jax was like, dumb. <laughs> I think that was the one. <laughs> he wasn't even hit by it. <laughs> that that Jax is insane um, with a tip box. Regardless, yeah, we'll see. We'll see Antwerp trying. Yep, that's that's it. I didn't have to. <laughs> Every member of the minimum of 10 of damage at 10% though. Ah, uh, okay. Giga Drain has a 10. Oh, this is just a fix uh, that he always. Oh, okay, that's nice to know. That explains a lot, actually. Now we're gonna see. Uh, oh, AY is uh, this whiffing. And, uh, Doggy almost with Mira and uh, Gyridis. Nice. Oh, no, we've punished that. And, uh, more Mira Drain here by uh, Antwerp. Vintini call, yes. see him make a go. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah, getting the crit thanks to the Vintini. This is... Could be... I mean, he's already got meter, so I was going to expect yeah, him to get the damage. Yeah, that's fair enough. Well, drops it. Yeah, the classic American reset here, it's okay. Preempt? Goes for preempt. One with the... Ooh. Ooh, yeah. That was that was really lucky that that, that didn't hit Bergy. Now back in the field phase, this is a strong game from Bergy now. It's probably the first time we've actually seen Bergy play this cleanly in this set, and there it is. Bergy taking that round. That grab the root ballsy, in my opinion. He's also uh, ready for uh, for Antwerp. Yeah. yeah, that'll be a really useful uh, support addition too, because Bergy's sitting on full meter, so a lot of uh, very scary options sitting right there. Well, this there we go. Antwerp was just taking a shadow bomb. Yeah, I'm not sure why he took that one. Okay, oh, Leaf Blade whiffing there, he gets a, he's gonna be some decent damage right here. 
for no, not getting a reset. Goes for a GY. Ooh, I think he perfect blocked the shadow punch. That was good. Yeah, I don't know how you could do that. Oh, there it is. He's a sub uh, B8. Oh, oh so no. he was so lucky, and that's a confirm. Yep, it's actually a big win here for Antwerp. Uh, well, once again, the range. That is walk up and grab him. Oh, yep. Okay, <laughs> so Bergy gonna get a decent chunk out of this, um, unless he drops it. But... Oh, that burst exhaust. Okay, here it is. Yeah, he's got Mega Gengar. This is horrifying. Yeah, that oh, was. Okay. Oh, it was probably not the worst interaction there. I don't know why his shield flicker was for. Yeah, uh, trying to get out that shifts before he dies, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, okay, just, uh, please just, wait a few seconds. Yep. Yeah, just just walk backwards. He didn't have to interact, so he didn't want to. That was a really good um. Yeah, that was a really smart um. Oh. Really smart round. That's, I don't know why I lost that word. It's getting late into the set, so now I'm actually starting to like flub my own commentary. Yeah, I'm not too sure what the score is. Is it 2 1 or 2 1 1? Uh, 2 1 1, right? Yep. 1 1, I believe, yeah. On the Ferrum Stadium, the second worst stage. <laughs> I think, I think Bergy and, uh, it, I know, it might be Santa. Um, one of the two actually really like the stage. I think it actually is Santa. I don't know about Bergy. Yeah, it's kind of, yeah. kind of weird. <laughs> I mean, Victini appears on in the background of this stage, like flying around, and that's what Bergy uses. So I suppose yeah. it, it it could be one of Bergy's favorites. Just appeared then, so Ooh, Leaf Blade unable to actually punish, unfortunately, though. Ooh, that a JY, JY gonna land. We just see the damage rack up. That's oh, not a full it. combo, yeah, but but um. Oh, it's still in. Phase. Wow, I thought yeah, it Yeah, yeah. No, he's... Um, so I the combo actually I think didn't do that much PSP. Yeah. I think it's like, almost psp list. It's only Astonish. Yeah, and it was just, it's just a 21 hit that does the... the yeah, shift, usually. Okay. Ooh, he's, he's getting oh, his Astonishes, like, really well. He's not getting the rest of the combo, though. Ooh, no crit. Yeah, Victini here. Comes, here. Here comes the Victini, yeah. Or jumps, a good awareness there by uh, Antwerp, jumping the the Shadow Punch. Okay, Antwerp was almost a meter, I don't know how, he's been getting beaten the whole team, so... I said that with uh, Kick Up being on 40 HP. Don't know yeah, how this happened, but uh, it happened. <laughs> oh, the attacked. Seen another one. Leaf play crit, big damage right there. Jack dash, yep, nice. Oh, I think I'm gonna he's, reset, getting at the corner. He's getting, he's doing these uh, small interactions again. That's what actually um, that what that's what essentially won him the first set before though. To gain, oh, Ooh. he did do an upshot. I didn't realize that. And yeah, there you go. I, saw, he gets, I saw something. He gets um, he gets the debuff. He gets a double debuff. Sorry. Uh, so now he, he's sitting in a really good position here. Victini on board, but I. Oh no, that actually gets rid of his um, his uh, synergy debuff. The de the defense debuff was stacked second, so because yeah. of that, yeah, that's that's really unfortunate. Because now he can just work on. I guess. Yeah. Oh, barely though. It only lasts around five seconds. Yeah, but I think it might be enough if uh, Antwerp wins this. Did, did some damage. Bergy trying to zone out this uh, scepter from uh, running at him. Yeah, this is this is a very um. <laughs> they're just playing it around the same like same space the entire time around that mid screen. Oh, that Bergy just saying, Bergy getting sick of it, just homing in, and there goes the Mega Gengar. Oh, oh, oh this is good really option. Big damage on the, on the timer right there, and uh, oh. not anymore. He's forced to burst here if he wants to win the round. Burst, yeah, yeah, he yep, can't there lose is. that. Good job to Antwerp. That was really lucky, though. Bergy absolutely, um... Oh, there you go. Ice Bergy actually likes this stage, and it's Santa that hates it. But, um... That was really lucky for Antwerp, just being in that health range where he could actually recover enough to be able to take that round. Uh, so, yeah. 
We're back on Anthem Swim stage uh, yet again. I don't know how he's Fox doing Volcano this. Volcano again. I don't know how he's, he's <laughs> doing this, but I, he's. So yeah, Antwerp sitting on Antwerp sitting on tournament point at the moment. Bergie has to fight back. He hasn't really shown much life this entire set. Definitely a different uh, set to what we saw before. We've seen the occasional um, the occasional strong round from Bergie, but Antwerp playing ridiculously at the moment. I, I, I don't actually think that Antwerp's running whimsical. Yeah, he hasn't won the lottery. In any uh, he 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 could be running support actually to be able to get that um yeah Volta. just check yeah check if he gets um a Volta like both times or something but regardless this uh if, if there's a round three I don't know but yeah Bergie Bergie thankfully breaking out of that option with the eight Y but just forcing back in but oh. uh, Antwerp, Antwerp quickly able to respond to that Bergie pressing CA there I'm not even sure as to why but uh. I'd imagine it's a panic there. option. Yeah, that's probably fortunate. The detect. Oh, oh, that. Yeah, not aimed up. I don't think it hit if it. Wait, I think you could have killed the. I actually don't know. I, it doesn't do that much. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it would have hit if he aimed it up, and you can only combo if it's aimed it up. So, aimed up in the air. So I don't know. Ooh, not a punish. The oh. astonish. Or well, nearly jumping back into the pool. That would have been a bit bad, but. Oh, okay. Bomb. What comes Legendary next? Legendary 8x. Well, that's close enough. That does. I wasn't even looking at Bergie's health bar. I was looking at Ants, but yeah, Antwerp taking that first round, sitting on match point, tournament point, one round to go. Bergie needs to find his footing. He was, and, he uh, was, he was doing ooh. well in that previous round. That ooh, was good, good forward dash. Right yeah. And Antwerp no longer sitting on Mina. Meanwhile, Bergie. Sitting on the Mega Gengar might want to use it a bit early, just because that, uh, uh, because of that Abelto. I mean, if if he just loses the burst attack, he's still got the Mega Gengar in general. Like, yeah, I know it's a lot of damage, but like, it, it's not too much of a loss because the character is just so good. Oh, okay, who's seeing these? These are playing neutral, throwing out seeds, the Thornishes, some Shadow Balls. Ooh, and I'm winning the corner here. This is Ooh. gonna punish. Yeah, there he goes. He's locked out of um, Mega Gengar for a little while, getting that CA in the reset, oh, that getting reset. that grab too. This is a very good position for Antwerp. Back into field phase, setting up the JY. Victini's going to get him that meter he needs. Oh, and running Vic into Victini. Yeah, you, you, you never see Victini actually doing damage, but when, when it does, oh man, it does damage. And there we go, the Mega Gengar finally out. This oh, is right, scary. No, no, not quite, is it? I so yeah, you're right, yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right. Final round, see if he has the Avelt already. Yeah, he does, so it is support. Yep. Okay, we're gonna see... Oh, Antop actually think I stole the nugget from Bergy right there. <laughs> I, I, Antop probably, yeah, it's probably yeah. a better thing for him to do because he's sitting on meter Bergy not. Yeah. Being the crutch of his playstyle, this is important. Fortunately, we'll missing the whiff on it. But that's it's fine. Ooh. Antwerp keeping Bergie in the corner here, not letting Bergie play the game. Oh, Bergie's how that's pressed. <laughs> Bergie's just pressing options in the middle of this uh, board. Seat. He's got to stop that. Tries to go over, but unfortunately misses it. Yeah. Antwerp right. now in Mega. This is a bit of a taste of his own medicine. Seeing this Mega, and that's a shield break. Tries to grab in the middle of it. The board Wait, seat. Wait, how did him. The oh, board seat made him. Um, yeah. Yeah, and Antwerp's actually going to take that entire set very cleanly. And that'll be the entire tournament too. Antwerp is donezo and gets that. Yeah, that gets the like entire a... tournament under his name. That was really the... clean. Yeah, Antwerp has played really cleanly for the for that grand final. Apart from like a few uh, weird stuff, like uh, random leaf leads and uh, the dragon played by... dragon breath into burst attack. Yeah, and, and, and like getting outplayed by Mega Gengar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that'll be. That was just a clean round game. So yeah, these these definitely some of the cleanest I've ever seen Antwerp play. I um, yeah, apart from that one bit, I'm gonna keep bringing that up. Yeah. But um, 
I think Antwerp actually said he's okay to do an interview, so I'll actually... Um... Oh, the Antwerp interview? So in that case, uh, I'll be heading off. Ooh, thanks, thanks, chat, and good. thanks, James, and uh, thank you, uh, Coro and Antwerp, for uh, sponsoring the show. Ooh, good. Thank you. Th- thanks, guys. And we should hopefully have Antwerp join back in a moment. I don't know, though. I'm waiting for Antwerp to join Shit, back. that's me. Oh, oh there he is. Um, <laughs> I'm busy telling Bergy is wrong. Come on. About to use his mind powers. What, what's he wrong on? What's he saying? Saying, saying you can't get out of bullet seat pressure. I can as Blastos. Not very well, but I can as Blastos. If I can as Blastos, you can as Gengar. And just like... 50-50 in people, but it's not actually a 50-50 because it's got Mega Gengar CA. Let's complain about <laughs> Bullet Seed. <laughs> not bro. Anyways, and I'm gonna I'm gonna ask the question first. What the hell was that Dragon Breath? It was Raid. Ah, oh, okay. That that makes. <laughs> I don't <laughs> get it. Like, it. It didn't work, so I got punished no, for it. But it I'm gonna keep, I'll bring it up. No, I I was I don't know. <laughs> I've, I've always thought of you as the uh, the hit confirmer, not the um the. I mean, there's already no breath. reason not to use Dragon Breath. So. Ah, uh, yeah, I suppose that actually makes sense because um, it's a block string. Like it's better on block, on whiff, on armor, on everything. Like it's. Mm. But anyways, yeah. Um, in the middle of this season, we've had um a lot of a lot of sort of um, top placements from mainly Bergy Santo. Now you've broken in again after it being so long out of, um, I suppose out of this uh, season until this, uh, your your lockdown started. Now I'm in lockdown too. Um, do you have any sort of, I'll start off with, do you have any sort of bracket demon? Um, Santa's age slash, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> It was was that, um, was that who you lost to in? No, I lost. Lost, lost to King. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. No, nah, it's fair <laughs> enough. I mean, considering it's Aegis slash and everything. I don't it know. Is, it's not fun. <laughs> <laughs> it's Aegis slash. It's, it's, yeah. There you go. Ant, Ant's bracket demon is Kermo. There you go. Um, you, you used to be Kermit's Lee, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's the opposite. Then, what happened? Like, that's like my bracket angel. Really? Did I, pick, I think I picked up Garchomp and then he picked up Lucario. <laughs> Some <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> um, <That was> fun. <laughs> uh, for like. If you who is your more, more comfortable comfortable pick between Marchamp and Septile? Obviously, we saw the Septile later, so Septile. I think that's I've been yeah. Septile for like five years now. <laughs> <laughs> but um, do you know much about like the the Marchamp against like the top players? Uh, say Gengar, the Aegis slash uh, uh, Gardevoir sort of matchup. Do you know the Marchamp end of them ones well at all or slightly? Wait. Just said a bunch of character names. What are you saying? Ah, oh, um, <laughs> no, I don't follow. So, I suppose, how comfortable are you with Marchamp against uh, specific like high player, high placing player characters, such as like Aegis slash we've uh, seen right. Santa, uh, um, guard we've seen from Enigma. I mean, depends on the day. Like all I gotta do is like get him <laughs> once. That's like, true. I don't think anything's like unwinnable. It's just. Most of them don't deal with Septar well, so it's yeah, like... yeah. Is there any is there any matchup out of like out of all the sort of players you can think of in the OCE sort of weekly and Singapore by extension that you would prefer using Marchamp against uh, rather than Septile? Um, mainly just Santa. San- ah, yeah, yeah. With the Aegis slash, that makes sense. Oh, I don't have to play Septile Age Slash. Apologies yeah. for the dog. <laughs> no, it's all good. 
Um, I mean, I had dogs barking last week, so it doesn't matter. Um, I don't know. There's, I, I just really like my champ vs guard. I think it's a lot of fun. But yeah, if I'm playing yeah. a win, I'm not gonna play it. Cause... Yeah, it's a very volatile matchup. I've played that myself. Um, you can tell it's unscripted. I just have to think of things on the fly. I should I should probably start writing down questions because I did that last week and I think that was probably the cleanest it's been. Um, I suppose I'll ask. I'll, I'll just ask the same thing I asked uh, Bergy when he did. Actually, just first of all, that's another losers run. That's another losers run tournament. We've had uh, six out of the, no, yeah, six out of the last seven weeks have been a losers run tournament. So, uh, yeah, nice job on that, but I was mainly going to get to, um, do you get exhausted when, like, kind of doing a loser's run? Although yours wasn't as long as... Actually, no, yours was pretty long, wasn't it? Because you um, didn't lose in, um... No, it was, it was like three games. Three games more, or... Because who was... did you... If you remember, who did you play against? I played mid and winners, then Bergy and winners. Then I got sent down to losers, and I played Freddy Enigma. Bergy. Oh, okay, so it actually wasn't. Ah, oh, no, that's alright then. Still, uh, no, I was gonna ask, like, um, do you really, like, do you get exhausted at all with it, but uh, that's not massively. Yeah, Cause, I mean, I do for long cassettes, but. Hmm, because I, I do remember that being a thing you've actually mentioned prior. That's more like social exhaustion yeah because <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> like when when we finally get a major it's like we, we come in on like we have a group dinner like friday night and we get up at like eight o'clock on the saturday spend all day playing have another dinner that night go home come in eight o'clock like go to bed at like midnight then back in the city by eight o'clock on sunday to play top eight and it's like wow that's far. <laughs> yeah, so as far as I'd... bracket exhaustion goes, uh, it wouldn't it be. Is, it's not too bad. Yeah, it wouldn't be too bad for like a weekly. Um. Yeah, I can't really think of way too many more. I was going to ask, like, uh, did you kind of have a realization point where it's like, um, yeah, I've got this in the bag. Uh, or did you just kind nah. of play it out? I, I just play it buttons. out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> buttons. Yeah. I'll we'll push the leaf play button a lot more now. And, uh, yeah, yeah. I, people run into it, which is great. You definitely played a lot more aggressive, uh, a lot less patient tonight than I, I will today, yesterday, whatever, that um, I've ever seen you play. Because you're usually this patient, like, calculator player. Today I just saw you go, like, okay, leaf play. Yeah. yeah people are too complacent. Yeah, it worked. It worked at some point. So, <laughs> <laughs> reacting to leaf blade that's like borderline. Nah, when I armor something, you should see it. You see through it every time. Like, you got the extra hit stop, slows the game down. You should be able to see that. I was saying the reactor. <laughs> yeah, Chroma's Chernobyl. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's an Among Us reference. <laughs> Um, yeah, other than that, I don't really have too much, because, I mean, you've won quite a lot, obviously. This time, obviously, you've got a, um, more, like, more competition for first place. I think I'm almost well and truly out of that, uh, running, because I've only, I'm only beating one of the top five players now. But I'd say, I'd say you're, like, way up there, uh, probably about tied with, uh, Bergy after tonight. For that first, do you reckon uh, you can take another one, or is it gonna take is it gonna take a lot more than what you've seen? Like, I mean, I miss like two thirds of the season. Yeah, <laughs> so, yeah, that's. True. I don't know how good but, my chances are. Yeah, but even then, in the I mean, I'm I'm gonna talk down at you, but um, in the ones that you have been in, uh, even then, you have uh, you because you got fourth last week, I believe. Something like that. Yeah, and it's very important, but this definitely does boost your chances quite well. Winning, I think winning any tournament for the rest of this mm -hmm. month is just a massive boost in chances, so yeah, hopefully we see another one yeah. from you. 
the one oh, from okay. Bogey, one from Enigma, another one from Santa. Hopefully, me, but but um, you gotta yeah, join one first. Yeah, I'll. <laughs> I was actually I was actually doing oh, <laughs> cleaning the room. It's all right. No, no, no. That was, I mean, yeah. No. All right. I'll leave it that. Uh, any final words that you want to say before I close things up? I right, get fucked, Perky. Yeah. That's yeah. <laughs> no, all good. Thank you for this, and of course, thank you for commentating earlier in the bracket. Um, oh, good. Yeah, that'll be that. So that's Antwerp. You can chill around for the uh, remainder, or you can leave. That's up to you. But yeah, uh, thank you everyone for uh, tuning in to this uh, Winter Weekly uh, 2021 number 18. We're near the near the closing of this um, this month at the moment. Icebergy and Antwerp. Uh, second and first, respectively, are the front runners for this season. Though the, uh, the third, fourth, and fifth aren't too far behind. Though the fifth is falling, and that might be me. But yeah, we'll check that out later anyway. But thanks everyone for coming out. Thank you, Coro, for running this production. And thank you, Coma and Antwerp, for commenting. And thank you for uh, coming out and watching and supporting the stream. So cheers for that. Um, I'm going to leave. I don't know what I'm going to play. Uh, and it's not League Coma, but um, that'll be that. So thanks everyone for coming out, um, and I'll leave you all to it. Uh, wear a mask, get vaccinated, stay safe. Thanks everyone.